The James Webb Space Telescope, furthermore known as Webb or JWST, is a consistent trailblazer that has uncovered surprising bits of knowledge concerning stars, planets, universes, and other fascinating limitless quirks, as well as setting new standards for scientific energy. Webb is hailed as the respected Hubble Space Telescope replacement. Individuals from one side of the planet to the next are exchanging photos or using unrefined data to make new discoveries. Point three minutes ago, James Webb captured the most disturbing picture ever found in history. One year has passed since the impressive James Webb Space Telescope uncovered its absolute first paramount image of the universe, shocking stargazers across the world with its excellent detail. Yet its most recent finding is an astounding picture of the universe that we have never seen before. What has been viewed as doing this point by the James Webb Space Telescope is revealing more breakthroughs than it manages, scientists say. The replacement to the Hubble Telescope uncovered new information about star formation, universe combinations, and the early universe. Only one month after the initial photos were released, the photographs were dazzling, revealing the universe exhaustively. Since then, the number of disclosures has taken off, giving scientists a tremendous data treasure trove. James Webb Space Telescope's images of grandiose tarantulas, record-breaking space smoke, stars nearly their vast blast impacts, and other marvelous sublime articles have been filed. This satellite observatory's best-in-class advancements allow us to peer farther into space than before, uncovering previously dark nuances about the universe. Some of this is organized as a method for recalling the first year of the James Webb Space Telescope's activity. NASA released an image showing a small star-forming region in the Ruchi Cloud Complex. The image shows planes shooting from baby stars as huge buildup surges of various varieties influence nuclear hydrogen, which makes up the red buildup. The presence of a circumstellar disk creates some speculations about a few stars, suggesting the possibility of planet formation in the distant past. The image could show impressive disorder yet, according to NASA, this glorious nursery is small and peaceful compared to others. The energetic stars in this region are about the size of our sun or even smaller, making it the closest star-forming region to Earth. This picture was captured by the primary camera of the observatory, the Webb Space Telescope's near-infrared camera, which captures stunning images in two distinct infrared ranges simultaneously. Additionally, the Space Telescope has enhanced our understanding of exoplanets, or planets that orbit stars other than our Sun James Webb is particularly adept at studying distant massive galaxies. The Satellite Observatory discovered its first exoplanet LHS 475b at the beginning of 2023. The planet is 41 light years away and has a diameter similar to Earth's. James Webb, according to NASA, is the only operational telescope capable of sequencing the atmosphere of Earth-sized exoplanets. The discoveries illustrated how precise the telescope was. Rough exoplanets are now another frontier for astronomers to explore. The James Webb Telescope also found evidence of ancient galaxies that, from a theoretical perspective, shouldn't have existed. The Evolution Lab of Swindon School and its cosmic team have discovered six epic ancient galaxies called Universe Breakers, which could significantly impact our understanding of space. These colossal galaxies might have appeared between 500 to 700 million years after the Big Bang, according to the experts' results. Recently, the telescope's infrared sensors detected them, allowing us to look back in time about 13.5 billion years when stars and galaxies were much more settled. The massive size of the universe breakers has left scientists puzzled. Galaxies in the early universe should have been 10 to 100 times smaller than their current size. These six objects may be billions of times heavier than our sun, and the overall mass of stars in a single galaxy could be 100 billion times heavier than our sun. Does the idea of trying to comprehend something so massive make you feel uncomfortable? Despite technological advancements, planets that are extremely large to exist have experts baffled. None more so than the discovery of a planet thought to be too massive for its star. This has led to a reassessment of our entire understanding of planet formation and planetary system design. A planet that is many times as large as Earth has been observed, according to research from Penn State. Rumors suggest that this planet is in a planetary system around the ultracool star LHS 3154, a star that is many times smaller than our Sun. Before actually seeing it for themselves, scientists didn't think such a situation was possible. 
Yet new evidence shows that the largest planet in our planetary system is indeed orbiting one of the universe's smallest, coolest stars, an ultra-cool dwarf. We still have almost no understanding of the universe. This discovery shows that a planet of this mass orbiting a star with such a low mass defies our expectations. These stars might have formed in huge gas and dust clouds. Planets might emerge from the gas and dust that remain in the disk of material around the newborn star. However, it is not hypothesized that the planet-forming disks around the low-mass star LHS 3154 contain enough solid mass to produce this planet. Nevertheless, it exists, so we must now reconsider our theories about stellar and planetary evolution. A good analogy is balance. A star with an external heat source must maintain its internal temperature. You need to get closer to the heat source as its temperature decreases. Planets are the same. Planets that should be warm enough to support liquid water must be closer to their stars. For example, Earth is in the habitable zone because of the warmth and light it receives from the sun. The distances of various planets from our sun are either too great or too small for them to receive the right amount of light to support life. Now imagine a universe with a much cooler star. Moving closer to the fire would be similar for planets orbiting a cold star to get the right amount of energy to support life. The planet size should also be adjusted to provide the best distance for energy and light to support life. Returning to our previous discussion, there are different hypotheses for why the planet could have formed near the small star. According to a widely held belief, the planet might have been much larger initially over time, the planet would have lost a significant amount of its mass. However, this theory has a major flaw because large mass causes a planet to lose more gas than solids. In this case, it is hypothesized that most of the planet's mass would have been ashes which is inconsistent with the finding. Another explanation is that this massive planet formed far from the small star. If the planet was able to avoid getting too much light, it would likely be ice-covered. The star could eventually gravitationally attract this distant planet resulting in this massive planet being close to the small star. Although there is a possibility that both ideas could explain the observed planet-star pair, Scientists are still unable to fully understand the anomaly with state-of-the-art technologies like JWSD. Researchers are now examining planetary systems in greater detail and each new finding is pushing them forward. We have delved more deeply into how the universe has formed over the past months than we have in the last 30 years. The vast amount of data provided by the telescope has already led to major scientific advances that have amazed astronomers and sparked interest in future space exploration. With the James Webb Space Telescope in operation for a year now, one thing is certain the universe is far more complex than we previously imagined, and there are many questions we have yet to answer. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, launched by NASA in December 2021, represents a monumental leap forward in our quest to understand the cosmos. Dubbed as the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope, JWST is equipped with advanced technologies designed to capture unprecedented views of the universe across a broader spectrum than ever before. At the heart of JWST's capabilities is its massive primary mirror, boasting a diameter of 6.5 meters, 21.3 feet. This size is more than double that of Hubble's mirror, allowing JWST to collect and focus significantly more light. This increased light-gathering power enables JWST to observe fainter and more distant objects with exceptional clarity and detail. Point. One of JWST's key instruments is the Near Infrared Camera NIR Cam, essential for observing the universe in the infrared spectrum. Infrared light is crucial for studying celestial objects because it penetrates cosmic dust clouds that block visible light, revealing hidden stars, galaxies, and planetary systems. NIR CAM operates in two infrared wavelengths simultaneously, providing astronomers with valuable data on the temperatures, compositions, and movements of distant celestial bodies. Another critical instrument on board JWST is the Near Infrared Spectrograph, NIR SPEC, which breaks down light from distant objects into its component colors or spectra. By analyzing these spectra, astronomers can determine the chemical composition, temperature, and motion of stars galaxies, and exoplanets across vast distances. This capability is invaluable for studying the formation of stars and galaxies, the evolution of planetary systems, and the atmospheres of exoplanets. JWST's mid-infrared instrument, MIRI, complements NIR-CAM and NIR-SPEC by focusing on even longer infrared wavelengths, 
essential for studying the coolest objects in the universe. MIRI's advanced detectors and spectrographs enable detailed observations of cold gas clouds, dust-shrouded star-forming regions, and the thermal emissions from distant planets. Together with NIRCAM and NIRSpec, MIRI provides a comprehensive view of the universe across a broad range of infrared wavelengths. One of the most anticipated capabilities of JWST is its ability to study exoplanets, planets orbiting stars beyond our solar system. JWST's powerful instruments allow astronomers to analyze the atmospheres of exoplanets as they pass in front of their host stars, a technique known as transit spectroscopy. By measuring the changes in starlight filtered through an exoplanet's atmosphere, JWST can detect gases like water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane, providing insights into the planet's climate, composition, and potential habitability. In addition to its scientific instruments, JWST's orbit around the second Lagrange point, L2, approximately 1.5 million kilometers, 930,000 miles, from Earth, ensures minimal interference from Earth's atmosphere and heat. This stable vantage point allows JWST to maintain a consistently cold temperature, essential for its infrared observations, and provides uninterrupted views of the universe for extended periods. The journey to launch JWST has been decades in the making, with international collaboration among NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA. Each agency contributed unique expertise and technology to the telescope's development, ensuring its success as a global endeavor in space exploration. Scientifically, JWST aims to address fundamental questions about the universe's origins, evolution, and composition. By observing the universe in infrared light, JWST can peer through cosmic dust clouds, study the formation of stars and galaxies, and explore the conditions necessary for planets to form and sustain life. These observations will build upon the discoveries of previous telescopes like Hubble and revolutionize our understanding of the cosmos. One of JWST's primary scientific goals is to study the first stars and galaxies that formed in the early universe. By detecting the faint infrared light emitted by these ancient objects, JWST can probe deeper into cosmic history than ever before, unraveling the mysteries of how the universe transitioned from a hot, dense state to one filled with stars, galaxies, and eventually, planets. Another key area of exploration for JWST is the study of star formation and planetary systems within our own Milky Way galaxy. JWST's high-resolution imaging capabilities allow astronomers to observe protostars, the precursors to stars, embedded within dense gas clouds. These observations provide insights into the processes that drive star formation and the formation of planetary systems around young stars. Furthermore, JWST's observations of planetary systems beyond our solar system offer a glimpse into the diversity of exoplanets and their potential for habitability. By studying the atmospheres of exoplanets, JWST can identify chemical signatures that may indicate the presence of life-supporting conditions, such as liquid water or organic molecules. These discoveries will inform future studies and missions aimed at finding Earth-like planets capable of hosting life. Beyond its scientific objectives, JWST represents a technological marvel in space engineering and instrumentation. The telescope's complex deployment sequence, which includes unfolding its segmented mirror and sunshield, required precise engineering and testing to ensure successful operation in space. JWST's instruments underwent rigorous testing to withstand the harsh conditions of space, including extreme temperatures, vacuum environments, and radiation exposure. The development of JWST also pushed the boundaries of international collaboration in space exploration. Scientists and engineers from around the world contributed to the telescope's design, construction, and testing, leveraging expertise in optics, material science, aerospace engineering, and astrophysics. This collaborative effort ensured that JWST would achieve its scientific goals and pave the way for future space missions. Looking ahead, JWST promises to revolutionize our understanding of the universe and inspire future generations of astronomers, scientists, and space explorers. The telescope's unprecedented capabilities will enable discoveries that were once thought impossible, 
from unraveling the mysteries of dark matter and dark energy to studying the atmospheres of distant exoplanets. Moreover, JWST's discoveries will have profound implications for our understanding of Earth's place in the universe and our potential for life beyond our solar system. By studying planetary systems and their evolution, JWST will provide insights into the conditions necessary for habitability and the factors that shape planetary environments over cosmic time. In conclusion, the James Webb Space Telescope stands at the forefront of 21st century astronomy, poised to revolutionize our understanding of the universe. With its advanced instruments, international collaboration, and ambitious scientific goals, JWST represents a testament to human ingenuity and curiosity about the cosmos. As JWST begins its journey of exploration, it holds the promise of unveiling new discoveries, answering fundamental questions about our origins and existence, and inspiring future generations to explore the wonders of the universe.